I'm out of the shop tonight to do a little experiment. Sometimes when you go to craft shows with your scroll saw projects to sell, you don't always have power available, and it's nice to be able to have your scroll saw there and do some demonstrations. So I happen to have the uh, Mobile Power 2001 Instant Boost 400 uh, that I carry around in my work truck, and uh, I thought I'd give it a try here on the scroll saw. So here I have the uh, scroll saw plugged in, and I'm just starting, and you can see my battery power is at 100%. Uh, I've done some test cuts at this point, and the uh, power of the saw seems to be fine. It, it, uh, running fine I can make adjustments to the uh, speed of the scroll saw and uh, so I thought I would turn this thing on just let it run at about uh, I'm running at about 70% speed and I'm not doing a lot of cutting on it so I'm sure that's going to cut down the time but I'm going to time this thing and just see how long it'll run uh, so we'll let it run here for a little bit and then we'll come back after about an hour and see how we're doing Okay, let it run for an hour. Let's uh, take a look at the uh, clock. You can see I started the clock about 20 minutes late there. Uh, so it's actually right at an hour. And uh, let's test the uh, battery power and see where we're at. After an hour, we're still at 100%. I did some test cuts and uh, still had plenty of power to uh, make a cut. So again, let's let it run for a little bit. I'm back now and we're at about 2 hours and 20 minutes. Uh, I've just been making test cuts so I'm sure that uh, if he were cutting the full time uh, it would probably uh, reduce this just a little bit. Uh, we're going to push the button here and you can see we are at about 75%. So uh, we're going to let it run a little while. I also decided I would check the uh, battery and uh, just see how uh, much uh, the heat uh, might play a part in this thing so I got my little uh, uh, laser heat finder here and I'm going to just point it at the battery it looks like we're running at about 67 degrees so uh, I haven't seen any heat build up in the battery at all Okay, I'm back at the scroll saw again now, and I think we're at about 3 hours and 10 minutes. I just made a cut, and uh, before I checked the battery power here, I was able to make a cut. Uh, when I push the power button, you can see we're in the red. The battery is almost drained. Um, I, uh, again, started the clock about 20, about 20 minutes late, so we're at about 3 hours and 10 minutes. The uh, heat of the battery has not changed at all. We're right at, again, about 67 degrees. Right after I took this measurement and uh, stopped the video, I tried to make another cut and the scroll saw event, uh, finally died. So uh, total count was about three hours and 10 minutes. So I would say this experiment is a success with a question mark. The Mobile Power 2001 Instant Boost 400 can be purchased at Amazon.com. Uh, the current price is $121.55. Um, I think this Mobile Power would probably be sufficient to get you through some short demonstrations while you're selling your products at a show. I have not tested the product in that environment, so I don't want to make any guarantees. Uh, but it looks uh, interesting. Uh, I have seen other people take car batteries and a power inverter and make their own, uh, but this would be an all-in-one uh, device that uh, not only could you use at your scroll saw uh, events, but you could also carry it in your car to jumpstart your battery and charge your mobile phone devices. It also has a uh, built-in air compressor, which I've used a couple times to... Uh, inflate some low car tires so uh, it's a pretty nice device just to have anyway and an interesting device to possibly allow you some mobile power for your scroll saw